Hello and a huge welcome to this video. I'm Scorpion from How To Do and in this video we will be learning how to make a cover system uh, that is really easy to make and actually we won't have to make the cover. Uh, it is already made for us. So we are gonna use this cover uh, asset that is free to use and we're gonna use this in our game and let's see how to use it in our game. So this is pretty cool asset uh, that you can use in your games. Alright, so it has dynamic covers like low cover and high cover so that was the high cover and I can also take the low cover and then again I can jump from this cover to a vault I, and there is also a weapon system over here as you can see uh, I can pick up the weapons but this is not what we're gonna uh, do today so we're not gonna look at the weapon system we're gonna just look at the cover system and how to implement that but there is pretty cool uh, weapon system as you can see uh, this is pretty pretty cool and then you can change between the weapons like that and then and there is the appropriate animation for these weapons like this is for the pistol and then you can change to uh, AK-47 and then yeah pretty cool Bam. so let's see how to use this asset inside of your game first thing what you will need is to download this asset right so if you don't know how to download free assets um let me just quickly show you guys this is the asset which we're going to use cover plus shooting and as you can see it's not free it's 30 dollars so what you have to do is you have to download it for free if you don't know how to download free assets then go to my channel which is how to do go ahead and check out my channel in there you will find loads of tutorial videos and there is one tutorial which is somewhere over here this one how to get paid assets for free 100% free and yeah you will find out how to download them I have already downloaded loads and loads of them as you can see over here I have downloaded all of these for free look at that for free so if you want to learn how to download all these assets for free make sure you uh, check out my video the link will be in the description box below so when you do that you will be able to download this asset all right and then what you will have to do is you have to make a new uh, unity uh, project scene and then you have to import it so let me just go ahead and show you guys how you import it so if i go to downloads and it is this one oops sorry 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 so when you have downloaded it then you have to go ahead and drag it inside of unity just like this and then release it and I already have imported inside but let's see what happens I already have imported it so as you can see it's unchecked everything but you have to check both of them and there is this project settings so uh, make sure you check that because as you can see uh, this is actually the main part because it also takes care of the input manager because otherwise if you do not import this uh, package manager uh, the uh, project settings then uh, what will happen is that um, uh, what will happen is that your uh, input are not you know set so your controls are not set and then you will have to set them by yourself and then you don't know how to set them so make sure you make a new project scene otherwise if you override your project settings then it may you know mess up with your unity inputs and all that and you don't need that so make sure you make a new project scene a new project all right new unity project and then import both of them in there so i'm gonna import it and there we go all right and then you will see this uh, shoot plus cover folder and there you will find these scenes and there are these two scenes i'm gonna don't save anything and then there's this tutorial scene so let me just go ahead and play it for you guys so let's see what happens when i play it so as you can see we have a third person character controller this character is really really cool and then we can of course walk around run around and then when we come over here we see that kind of pretty cool uh, thingy going on here and when we press middle mouse or you can uh, hold f2 in order to check the uh, uh, the controls so hold f2 to check the uh, you know controls and then you can uh, press the middle mouse to get inside the cover all right and it's uh, nicely working and all that so let's see how to use this okay so get out of the game view and I already have gone ahead and down uh, the I already have gone ahead and imported my Franklin in there and I'm gonna go ahead and select all the materials and set them back to normal because they are purple right now so let me just go ahead and set that to standard and there we go set that to that and there we go cool 
So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go to the scenes which have the scenes and trial and don't save that there we go there's the character all right so i have to drag in my franklin 3d model so you can use any 3d model i have this 3d model right here uh, of franklin if you don't know uh, how to download 3d models from any game like sniper elite or just cause or any game make sure you see my video on this one how to get 3d models from any game 2019 and use them in your game so make sure you do that and there are a whole lot of tutorial videos like sniper elite for x-ray vision and sniper scope effect sniper delete for uh skull breaking system camera collision and all that make sure you see them all right uh that will help you a lot and then drag and drop your rigged anime uh, uh, rigged character in there uh, inside of the uh, character shadow which is this character all right so if you don't know how to rig and animate your character the link will be in the description box below make sure you see that it is really really easy to rig and animate your character in just two minutes so then when you have dragged in your character inside of this uh, player then make sure you reset the transform so that it's 000 so it's right inside of this in center of this uh, character if it's not like in my case it's still out there so I'm gonna go ahead and drag it back a bit and then maybe make it smaller so that it matches the height and all that and then after we have done that we're gonna go ahead and drag that out and I'm gonna go ahead and say unpack the prefab because I don't want that okay so now what we have to do is we have to just copy the components and then paste these components in there so uh, first of all is the animator controller so copy the component oops sorry 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 copy the component and then paste that in there and then make sure the avatar is the same one as you have in my case it's franklin so make sure it's franklin and the other settings are good then there's rigid body so copy component paste component values and as you can see they have set the uh, rotation to freeze x y and z so you have to copy and paste the component so that the values are the same and then copy the capsule glider copy component paste that component in there and i'm gonna go ahead and make them that okay so then there are these all scripts that you need to copy and paste so first of all is the base behavior basic behavior and then paste that basic behavior in there and then there is this move behavior so copy okay copy component paste component as new move behavior and then there comes the aim behavior copy paste as new I'm doing that so that the values are the same one as this guy has so make sure you copy and paste them otherwise you may end up with something else shoot behavior cover shoot and then last one is the footstep copy paste as new so one two three four five six and one two three four five six and then these three and then these three so cool so now we have everything that we need but one thing uh, that you will also need is that as you can see in the character over this one we have the tag player so make sure this character this new character also has the tag player all right and then we can disable this character and then we can go ahead and play the game and see what's happening so as you can see the camera is not set up correctly and we can move around however the camera does not follow the character so let's go ahead and take care of that so when we go to main camera as you can see there is this player follow thingy and you have to drag in your uh, draw your uh, player so in my case it's not this character which is just disabled this is the one which we want the camera to follow all right and now when we play the game we will see that the player uh, the camera will work nicely so we can run around we can also jump around and then if i come over here and press uh, middle mouse he is gonna take cover and he's gonna move like this and he's gonna move like that and then we can also jump like that and then we can run around and jump and take the high cover there we go and then we can move around and then we can you can see there is this kind of really cool ui thingy and then we can turn and then we can also turn and then we can get out of the cover pretty cool so uh, let's see when uh, are the weapons working or not I think they will not work properly 
let's see so if i press e to take the weapon as you can see the offset of the weapon is not proper and then when i uh, take the scope he will look on the opposite side and but the weapon is quite nicely working but the animations are not working right so if you want me to make the tutorial on how to uh, set up these uh, animations nicely then make sure you uh, let uh, let me know in the comments below uh, and i will make the tutorial video however the animation is nicely working the player offset of the weapon is not proper so yeah we will see what we do but i don't think so that this is necessary for today's video because it was only for the cover system and the cover system is properly working as you can see nice so this is how you implement cover system in your game and you don't need to have these weapons in there so just go ahead and remove these weapons and then you can copy the component and copy the player and then or change this scene into any scene or yeah you can do anything you want but the cover system is there right so guys this was the short video on how to implement the cover system hope you guys enjoyed and yeah this is it if you want me to make uh, some other tutorial like uh, this one was on request of someone uh, and I just made it for him he was asking me to how to make a cover system and I thought it was really easy so I just made this uh, yeah with the unity asset store available and then that site there from which you can download the assets for free you can do anything you want like so yeah pretty cool right so then you can use this asset inside of your game and yeah make your game publish your game make sure you like this video hope you guys enjoy it make sure you subscribe to the channel if you want you can also donate me some money through paypal the link will be in the description box below and i will see you in my next video bam and there's also a camera collision system that is pretty cool but I already have made a tutorial on how to make a camera collision system that is much much better than this. As you can see we can go through this wall. But in my case it's not that. So yeah. Cool. Let's see you in the next video.